Hey folks, welcome back to Otter Tail Home Center, and I'm Dewey. I'm Eric. <laughs> Everybody knows that by now, don't Unless they? Unless I change my name. <laughs> I kind of wonder if I... You know, Pedro. Pedro. <laughs> hey, today we're in the basement of a new home. Yeah. And uh, maybe some people out there don't realize that there's more options out there than a concrete block or poured walls or, you know, things like that. Yeah. Um, you know, one of the things that we want to point out, this here is a wood treated basement. Um, very nice, very straight. And warm and dry. Because we use prime pine number one select grade. Mm -hmm. And it's all 0 .60 ground, or ground direct burial. Uh, and that's very important to uh, to the wood basement process, and uh, it's it's all direct burial, so it you know it, it's a pressure treated lumber. It it doesn't rot. Yeah, and it, this is back to the same old scenario. This couple had a house plan, and they needed to trim some cash off of it. Mm -hmm. This is one thing that we were able to help them out with. We went with the wood basement, and that dropped, brought the money down a little bit. Absolutely. And then we went with some other things that we can point out later. Yep. But a nice thing about a wood basement, uh, say you get this all finished off in five years, you say, geez, I'd sure like to add another window here. Hey, you get your hammer and your saw out and you go to work. Yeah. You know, it's, it's not get your jackhammer out and a concrete saw and dust and, 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 dust and create uh, just a nightmare for yourself. These are very warm, very economical, uh, easy to finish off. Uh, yeah. And, you know, and you can, you can save some, some serious cash right off the top, you know. I guess while we're down here, we could talk about another thing is, is in this basement here, they did uh, um, two by 10 construction grade floor joists. Mm -hmm. And why did you go that road on this well, one? Well, it, it was another cost saver. Mm -hmm. You know, instead of doing engineered floor, uh, either floor trusses or TGIs, you know, uh, that kind of thing, uh, we could do a two by 10 or two by 12 and, and uh, really save them a lot of dollars and give them exactly what they needed for a floor. So they can afford to buy that jet ski lift and dock. Absolutely, in the dock. <laughs> in the dock. <laughs> so it worked out well, and it's, it's a very solid home, and it, you know, it's been construction uses that's been around forever. And another thing, you know, like uh, my wife, for instance, thinks basements are just dark dungeons and oh, no. just storage, and that's it. Yeah. You know, as you look around here, you'll see that we put some very large windows in here. Nice windows, egress windows for uh, you know fire escape windows and stuff like that for new new bedrooms and stuff. And one of the things I always wanted to point out was their patio door is a three wide three patio wide. door. Yep, really what? works well. It's at nine feet wide. That is, that's yep. a big door. Big door, and it works very well. Meets all energy codes. Absolutely. Tax right off. Mm -hmm. Yep, works good, but it uh, you know. Just getting back to the wood basements, you know, that they're warm, they're economical, they're safe, they're durable, they're easy to finish off, and, you know, we can help you out with that. So you don't have to go running all over the place getting this and that and everything else. Yeah. So, you know. And also the same contractor just takes care of it. Absolutely. Yep, he can help you out a lot better. So remember, folks, when you got something in the, in the works for your new house, need some ideas, basement on up, let us know. I'm Dewey. And I'm Eric. And we love selling boards. <laughs>